Nazareth uh, convent. And what they've discovered underneath is the actual home of Jesus. And you're going to go down to the excavation and she's going to let us see it and explain it to us. We're in a very special place at the Sisters of Nazareth convent in Nazareth, Israel. What they have discovered when they were removing some tiles is that they discovered this was the childhood home of Jesus, Yeshua. Through the artifacts they found, an ossuary uh, box that said Joseph, the father of Yeshua, this is what they found. Some other artifacts that are in the Israeli museum right now. But this would have been Jesus' home that he was raised in in Nazareth. Very special place. You can't get in here. It's not open to the public, but I have special permission to show you Jesus' childhood home. So come with me as I show you his home. At the time this was built, it would have, this would have been the ground level. And of course, everything's built over top as time goes on. But this area that I'm going to show you is one of the other artifacts that they found. And this would have been an altar. So after Jesus, Yeshua, was buried and resurrected, they turned this into a church, which is also another fact that it was absolutely the place of Jesus. This was a first century church that they would have come to worship the fact that this was Jesus' childhood and home. You can see the altar and everything around here. There's little oil lamp holes that would, they would have had the oil lamps. There's also a burial thing over here, um, but this definitely was the time of the church. This was what it would have worshiped after Jesus was resurrected. Come along and I'm going to show you this home. These steps here are all first century steps. Nothing's really been done too much to it except, of course, the modern rail railings. But everything is pretty much as you would have seen it in Jesus' time. This would have been the entryway to Jesus' home right here. Going in, it's amazing, this is still here. As you can see, the stairway, this would have all been outside. So this uh, stairway would have gone up to the rooftop. Where pe during the uh, summer it was cooler actually to be on the rooftop at night with the with the big breezes coming in and so if, when you see the stairways they were going up to people's homes they did a lot of their living upstairs cooking and and making their meals right here we find a trough this is probably the type of thing that Jesus was actually kept in a manger the mangers weren't wooden back then they, this was considered a manger where animals would eat so you would know that this was like a courtyard where they had their animals and their sheep and other and everything. But this is actually what they would have placed Jesus in, was this type of manger. Now the special thing I'm going to show you right now is this is Jesus' childhood home. This was the stairway going up to Jesus' home. And you visualize the rooftop, as you can start seeing the top of it here, this is the rooftop. And then here would be the outside patio area. Or Jesus, uh, they would have things on the on the patio, maybe a little fence here. But if you you can see in here, which we'll go around there later, this would have been the outside area of Jesus' home. And they know that from the several artifacts that they found right here that this was Yeshua Hamashiach's home, Jesus' home. This is you can visualize Mary and Joseph coming out here, cooking, uh, having friends over. This is where they would have been preparing a meal. There are animals right here. But another thing that's really interesting is the fact that they found first century. Uh, burial grounds here. So I'm going to show you that. And this is where they found the bones of Yesh Joseph, Yeshua's father. So let's go down here and I'll show you. So we're headed down to the burial ground where they found the ossuary box of Joseph, Jesus' father. The discovery was just made recently, literally within the last eight years. And the more excavating they do, the more they find. But the problem is we're right next to the Church of Annunciation where G Mary, the angels came and told Mary she was going to have a baby. So they can't really excavate underneath here. But what they did excavate is extremely important and it shows that Jesus was born right here in Nazareth. Also right here what I'm showing you is the tomb where they found Joseph's body. You can see the roll away stone and you can see all the burial grounds. So all of the uh, that area from this time in Nazareth were probably buried in this tomb.